Hello friends, welcome to SQL with Manoj. Today we'll see how to download SQL Server 2014 and from where, what are the available resources and what are your options. So here we go. I'll open IE and I'll search for SQL Server 2014. So it gives me two options. One is SQL Server 2014 Express and other one is SQL Server 2014. So SQL Server Express is a light version which is free and it has some limitations but SQL Server 2014 uh, is a full version, full BI suite. So first of all we'll see how to download SQL Server 2014 Express. So I'll open it in a new tab and this takes me to the download page of SQL Server 2014 Express. Uh, these are the following additions I can choose from. First one is the local DB. This is a lightweight version of Express. This Express is a full database engine. Uh, it does not contain SSMS. Express with tools. This is the database engine with SSMS. Only SSMS and Express with advanced services. So this is Express with tools plus full text search and reporting services. So we will be uh, downloading this version, this edition. Uh, please go through the system requirements and release notes before downloading. Click to register, download and install the full feature software here. Okay, so it will ask your Microsoft ID. That can be your Outlook account, your Hotmail account or uh, you can create a Microsoft ID with some other account like I have created with Gmail. Okay, so it takes me to this uh, download form where uh, you can provide your information that I've already provided before. First name, last name, email address and we are going to download this, the last option, Express with Advanced Services. So this is the database engine plus tools plus full text search and reporting services. I'll choose my language as English and country India and I'll click on continue. So by clicking on continue it will download directly download the exe file okay so as you can see here uh, this is the full version edition that we are trying to download and it is 1.12 gigs and you can either run it from here or you can save it so that you can use it on later so i'll uh, right now cancel it because i'm not going to download it i'll also close these uh, pages for express now we'll see how this uh, full version we can download. So I'll just click on this link. Okay, it takes me to the download the evaluation Microsoft Server 2014 SP1. So SP1 was released a few days back and you can see the features and updates that were fixed in uh, Service Pack 1. So these are the features that were fixed here. You can go through the system requirements and release notes before downloading. Register and download. Okay, so I have to select a version here. So it gives you three options. SP1 on Microsoft Azure, that is IAS. Um, ISO file that you can burn on a DVD. CAP file that you can just download, extract your MSI or EXE and directly install SQL Server from there. So I'll select CAP and get started now. Okay, it takes me to the same page as we saw with SQL Server Express. Um, here, uh, first name, last name, email ID, what is the version you want to download, 64-bit, um, English, country, India, and I'll just click continue. So here it won't directly give you the exe, it will take you to a different page. Okay, so this is the TechNet Evaluation Center page that we landed into, and you have an option of SQL Server 2014 SP1 as well as SQL Server 2012 SP1 and uh, this is uh, free for evaluation for 180 days. After expiration of 180 days you have to provide a key and that key you can get it from your MSDN subscriptions. So I'll expand SQL Server 2014 SP1. This is the full version and I will choose the cap and I'll click register to continue. Okay, so similar kind of page that it asked us previously. I'll just click continue. Okay, here is the page. Uh, your download has started. This download has multiple files. 
So it has two files .exe and .box. You can see here the .exe file 125kb and the box is the original file that would be around 3-4 uh, GBs. So just uh, save these files in your PC and uh, install SQL Server 2014 SP1 full version from here. Uh, thank you for watching this video. Please uh, let me know your comments. Thank you.